Hello, this is Norma and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be making some Liberian potato salad. For this one I'm going to be using some red potatoes. I'm going to be using some mixed vegetable. A yellow onion. Some luncheon meat. I'm going to be using four eggs and it's at room temperature. I'm going to be using some Duke's mayonnaise. Some paprika. Salt. And black pepper. The first thing you need to know before you make potato salad is you have to buy the bright potatoes. And they have three kinds of potato. They have the star sheet potato, the waxy, and the all-purpose. The reason why you need to know what potato to get because you want one that keeps its shape when it starts to boil. You don't want it to break up. And the starchy ones will start to fall apart. So it's better if you want to make creamy potatoes or mashed potato. The waxy potatoes are the best ones for potato salad. And the red potato is one of the waxy ones. You can also use Yukon Gold, which is an all-purpose potato. So that's the first thing. And now we're going to start. I'm going to wash all my vegetables and come back and we start making a salad. This step is very important. I've washed all my potatoes and you can either cut it up and boil it, move the um, peeling, cut it up and boil it, or you can leave it with the peeling. I'm going to leave it with the peeling and after it boil, I'm going to take the peeling off. But you don't have to put any salt yet. It's bland, but you're going to put it when the water starts to boil and you don't want to put your water let it boil and put the potato in there because a lot of times the outer part will be cooked and inside will not be cooked so it's always good to start off with cold water from the tap so we're going to put the cold water from the tap and I'm going to cover it and take it to my stove now we move it on to the onions. And this is how you want them. Cut up this small. I'm going to cut all of them and we'll be back. I've chopped up all the onions I'm going to be using and now we're going to move on to chopping up the luncheon meat. I have my luncheon meat and just open it with a can and always make sure you wash all your cans before you cut them because they be in the warehouse and then they be on the shelf and turn it over. If you don't like pork, you can skip this because the luncheon meat is pork. And this is the strips that I'm cutting them in. And I'll cut it all and we'll be back. I've chopped up all my luncheon meat and we're moving on to the mixed vegetable. I had it in my freezer and I'm going to take it, take some out and boil it for maybe about four or five minutes. 
I forgot to show you before I put my potato on the stove I added my four eggs and now that the water is boiling I'm gonna add some salt and that will season the potato while it cooks and the eggs and it's just gonna continue to cook The mixed vegetable pack has carrots, green beans, corn, and peas. Put a little bit here. I'll put some water. I don't need much. And I'm going to take it to my stove and boil that a little bit. I took the potato out and I'm going to let it cool before I start peeling it, I've got the eggs also that I'm going to peel and once they cool, we're going to come back. The mixed vegetable is ready, the egg is ready and the potato is cool to the touch so I'm just going to cut it. In squares. Like this. I'm going to cut all of them and we'll be back. I've cut all the potatoes in squares and I'm going to put salt, black pepper, my onions, my mixed vegetables. my luncheon meat I'm gonna mix that And you see, because I told you it's a waxy potato, the red one, it's not breaking up like if you had used one of them that was starchy. So now I'm going to add my eggs. My paprika. And I'm going to use the, let me pull this up, the Duke's mayonnaise. You should try that. start off with two heaps. I like my creamy. I'm gonna add some more mayo. And a little bit more paprika. My Liberian potato salad is all ready. And I'm going to plate my food and show you how I garnish it. I'm going to take it and put it in another plate.
And I have some of the boiled egg that I'm just going to take and garnish the salad. And my Liberian potato salad is all ready. I hope you try this recipe. Please subscribe, like, and hit that notification button so each time I upload, you will be notified. Bye bye.